Hey guys, in this video, we are going to retouch this image really fast so that we can focus on how to make the skin of the model to glow. I'll show you easy way to do this and this video contains method you've not seen anywhere else. So watch all the way to the end so that you can make the skin of your model to glow and improve your retouching in general. So here was the before and here is the after. So we are going to delete all these layers because we are going to retouch this image from the beginning. So we go to the beginning of the file. So we are going to retouch the skin. To retouch the skin, take your spot healing brush tool and clean any obvious pimples on the skin. You cannot clean these tiny, tiny pimples. Just zoom in like this. How are you going to fix this stuff like this? I'll show you real fast. A very easy way to do that. Let's just leave all these pimples on the face. Come to the action panel, click on auto fix FS action. If on your PC, if you are using a Mac, you see the auto fix for Mac. So right now on the PC, you are going to use auto fix FS. So just play the button like this and voila. Wow, look at the skin. Most of the pimples have been removed. So for the tiny ones that are still remaining, to remove them, we are going to flatten our image and apply the auto fix FS action once more. And just like that, all the pimples are gone. With just one click, you can fix your skin using the auto fix FS action. So we are going to max this one this time. Control I or Command I to invert the mask. Take our brush, make sure the foreground is white, increase the flow, and paint over the areas that we are seeing these pimples to remove them because the action has automatically removed them. But we don't want to apply this to areas that might look too smooth. So I'm just going to use a brush to do this manually. So that's how easy it is using the Autofix FX action to retouch even headshot like this to give you high-end results. It's super easy. Link is in the description to get the Autofix FX action. It's just $1. In support of the channel with just $1, you get this time saver action. It's super handy. Once you get it set up on your system, you know that it's worth thousands of dollars because it's going to save you lots of time in retouching and you can see the before of the image you can see the after see here was the before here is the after using the auto fix fs action link is in the description to get it right now so the next thing we are going to do we are going to make the skin to glow to do that we come to layer new layer Create a layer now, we change the blend mode to overlay. I'm going to click on the fill with overlay neutral color. We are going to click on OK. We are going to duplicate this into four. We are going to name the first one contour. We are going to name the second one general shine. We are going to name this one auxiliary shine. This can also be made into an action. I just want to show you the way you can create the action. But if you need the action, like you need the contour, dodge and burn action, you let me know in the comment section right now. You're going to name this last one, final shine. So you are going to come to the contour. You are going to come to channels. You are going to click on the load channel and selection. You are going to come to select and inverse the selection. I'm going to take our brush, make sure the foreground is black. Reduce the opacity to five. And you are going to paint on these areas like this. It's very easy, I just painted. Nothing much, you just paint softly on the skin. Look at this place on the chin, you are going to paint more on these areas. You're also going to paint on these areas as well. I'm going to paint on the nose area like this. I'm going to paint here. You're going to darken these areas just like this. The next thing we are going to do, we are going to come to the general shine. Come to select and inverse the selection one more time. Make sure the foreground is white this time around. We are going to paint on these areas to add shine to them just as easy as this. Uh, painting inside the selection this time around. I'm going to go to select and deselect. One the contour, we are going to come to filter, blow, 
Gaussian blow and we are going to blow this all the way to the radius of 100. We are going to click on OK. Wow, just take a look at the before and the after. Here was the before and here is the after. Now come to the general shine filter blow, Gaussian blow. And this time we are going to add a blow radius of 80. Click OK. Here was the before, here is the after. So you can see how easy this method of contouring is. Let's group these two together and name it dodge and burn. This is the easiest way to dodge and burn. The easiest way. Any other method is super difficult, but this is very easy. Here was the before and here is the after. I'm very sure you might have learned something new. So smash the like button right now. Please leave a fire emoji in the comment section. I really appreciate your efforts in contributing to the growth of this channel. The next thing we are going to come to the auxiliary shine. Take our brush, make sure the foreground is white. Now we are going to add shine to the lips like this. And this area we are going to paint. We are going to add more shine to particular areas like this, just to make the skin to glue very well. So you see, here was the before and here is the after, before and after. I know you are already loving this. I would like to share free offers to you guys on this channel. So let me know in the comment section if you are anticipating raw files that you can use for practice. For those of you that do not have enough files to use for practice, let me know so that I can put out link for raw files so that you guys get raw files you can use for practice. Here's the before and here's the after. So you can reduce the opacity of this one. We are now going to come to the final shine and then we are going to take our brush Make sure the foreground is white. This time, reduce the flow to one. We are going to make the brush size fat like this. We are going to paint on the chin. Paint down here. Paint here. And also here. This one is just a slight stuff you are doing before and after. Let's take a general look at the before and after of the shine. This was before. This is after. This is super amazing. This is going to make your image pop. It's going to add three dimensions to your image. And you are seeing the result right in this video. Please like the video. I really appreciate those of you that like my video. The rates of likes on the videos are very low. Please, I know you really like my video. So please indicate to YouTube that you like my video by smashing the like button. Click the like button right now to like this video. So let's take a general look at the before and after. You can see here was the before. Wow, look how rough the image is looking. Here is the after. And everything we did was super easy. Can't you see that on this channel, the tutorials we put out are very easy. Don't forget you can always turn down the opacity if the effect is much. I'm not going to over reduce opacities on this video tutorial so that you see how impactful the techniques I'm showing you really is. Opacity is left for you to do, adjust to taste, because you are going to retouch this on your own image. But for those of you that don't have images to retouch, please let me know in the comment section so that I can start putting out raw files for you to use for practice. So you can see how we fix the skin using the AutoFix FS action. Here was the before on the skin, and you can see after. We use the AutoFix FS action. It's available for PC and Mac. Link is in the description. It's very easy to use. It's the best way to get high-end skin retouching with just one click. This is the best action you can use to get results like this. There's no other action out there. And for just $1, that is not a sale. That is just a contribution to this channel. $1 contribution to the channel. You get the AutoFix FS action that you can use to retouch your image really fast. If you've been watching my tutorials, you see you, I've used it on several images so that you can see that it works on all image type, on all skin type, and result is great on all the skin that we have been retouching. You can also add skin tone lots. Come to adjustment layer, create a color lookup, go to your folder, select the lot that you need, and apply it. I'm not using this lot on this image right now, I'm just showing you that you can use a lot on your image. I have free lots on my website. Link is also in the description. Lots is a very easy way to color grade your image. So you can apply 
any of the lots that you feel that is nice on your image. Here was before applying the lots, here is after. You can check the link in the description. You can get free skin tone lots on my website. Link is also in the description. Also, get the Autoface FS Action so that you can start getting smooth skin like this with just one click. The result is super amazing. You can try it out for yourself. You can also add a selective color and continue to adjust the skin tone. All these are things we have gone in depth on other tutorials in this channel. So very easy to refine your skin. Very easy to retouch your skin. Everything on this channel is super easy to follow. If you are an absolute beginner, this is your first time trying out Photoshop. You can see it's very easy. Just check the link in the description to get my actions, the free ones, and the ones you need to contribute to the channel to get, get all of them. Start making money from your photography business and start retouching your images way faster than before. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more helpful tips, tricks, and cutting edge photography tutorials. Happy to be part of your creative journey. See you in another amazing tutorial.